What's up guys, this is Rich Light signing and welcome back to Deadly Premonition. I've only just seen little figurines on the mantelpiece and I have no idea what they are. At all. Anyway, we're in that mansion, so uh, I don't know whether to look around or not or just go for it. Fuck it, I'm just gonna explore. Oh, there's a weapon crate in here for some reason and a bed, just in case I get tired. Oh, hello. What's on this coat rack? Umbrella for guest room number four. What? What? Observe. It's unlocked. Could be quite comfortable if we decided to stay here. What? Okay. Why the fuck am I collecting umbrellas? Why? Do I need them for something? Yeah, alright. Next guest room, I say. Why the fuck am I collecting umbrellas? Do I need them for something? Do I need to do a puzzle with them? What's in here? Ah! Oh ho ho! I see! Okay! I think I might need the umbrellas for these guys. Maybe to speak to Harry too. I don't know. I want to look around a little bit more because I've got three of them. If there's any more rooms I'm going to take all the umbrellas I fucking can. Wow. Okay. Open the door slowly, York. That is how we deal with things. I still want to call you Sebastian. Oh, other side. I, I, I don't... Fuck off. I don't get it. Why am I collecting umbrellas? I don't... I'm confused. I am, like, literally heavily confused. This is going to be number one. Number two, sorry. Why is this? You know what? I'm just not gonna even, not even gonna question it. Not even gonna question it. I have six umbrellas now, apparently, and there's a seventh one somewhere. Right. What do we have? One, two, three. We've got four, five, and six. So is that all we need to go see Harry or not? What's inside this room? Huh. Observe. Reads drawing room. The door's locked but there's no keyhole. Could there be another way to open it? What about these guys? There's a switch on the statue. Should we push it? Would be funny if the mansion transformed into something unexpected. There's a switch on the statue. Okay. Well, now the door's gone red. So, what about you? There's a switch on the statue. Should we push it? Would be funny if the mansion transformed into something unexpected. Okay. Well, it's not opening. So, do I actually need the umbrellas then? Huh. Let's so actually have a look outside then, because that's the only door. That requires some assistance. It's going to be one of those tricky little puzzle things. So I've got three puzzles here. Okay, what do you say? A statue. Cavalry. Apparently it looks like it was meant to hold something. A Springfield rifle, perhaps? So we need a Springfield rifle. A statue of cavalry. Apparently it looks like it was meant to hold something. A Springfield rifle. Now, it's got to be an umbrella. Blah, 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 blah. What about a rifle? Okay, what about these guys over here? A statue of a cavalry trooper. I wonder what secrets it's holding. Okay, what's this on the wall? Anyway? It's like something brandished. Okay, you know what? I'm actually going to try and put these umbrellas down. Let's try room number five. Is that correct? I don't know if that's correct or not. 
His eyes have gone green anyway. I'm just gonna try six. Confused. Why I thought for something else. Try number one. Zach, something is still missing. We need more clues. One wasn't the right one then. Four? No. Zach, something is still missing. We need more clues. Okay. Three? There we go. How could you tell what you needed though? That's what I don't get. I actually just got lucky with that. How the hell did I get so lucky with that? How the fuck did I know what to do with them? That was... I just took a nice guess for that one, didn't I? Wow. And that is how you play the game. You get lucky and you win. I just start putting umbrellas down. Got lucky with the first two. <laughs> Got very lucky. Alright. So a little talk with Harry now. You can't speak to me, can you? Because you need your Mr. York Morgan guy. Unless you're going to reveal your face to me now. Ah. I don't know your name. I forgot your name. And I'm talking with Harry Stewart. Mr. Francis York Morgan. Hello. Please have some tea while it is hot. Okay. Too much coffee for your body will make it rot. <laughs> you seem well prepared. Almost as though you knew I would be coming today. Mr. Stewart is particular about the best timing for all things. So basically for all this time, we're probably always making a cup of tea for everyone we use. Of every moment of the time. I'm sorry, Harry, but I just don't like tea. It's red! Coffee, yes, make you a coffee. Coffee, 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 Harry, where did you get these seeds? Coffee, coffee seeds, seeds, coffee, coffee seeds, 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 coffee, coffee seeds, coffee seeds, seeds, coffee, seeds, 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 coffee, coffee, coffee seeds, 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 coffee seeds, 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 coffee, coffee. Mr. Francis York Morgan, those seeds. <laughs> Coffee seeds, seeds, coffee. <laughs> there we go. So you like to play games. Ooh. Mr. Francis, you are. You look like Fingy. A hint for you to find this location. It is most crowded, most quiet, and it gives a cold sensation. Graveyard? So says Mr. Stewart. So you're not going to talk unless I find this certain place. I'll play. Alright, that's enough for that coffee coffee talk, see talk, ding, tea break. Alrighty then. Well that's all I have to do with that. Gang somewhere? I'm not wearing a black suit, I'm wearing a red suit to match the things I'm finding. I got a lot of pennies. I'm gonna spend all that. Oh, I need to talk to the panda guy for bullets. We'll probably do that when we've got a lot of time of our hands. I need bullets. <laughs> oh wait, I wasn't able to buy any shotgun shells. Where are I? Please give me some shotgun shells, Mr. Panda Man. 
Kind of need those to continue playing the game. We'll start using the rifle or two, the machine gun. It might benefit everybody we see. Especially if I shoot them in the head. Because that is what we need. Seriously, it's got... Ow! <laughs> Alright. No for the coffee coffee seed thing. Oh, I should have said tea instead of coffee. Zach, let the treasure hunt begin. Yeah. A crowded place, and yet it is very quiet there. Have you figured it out, Zach? Graveyard. It's gotta be a graveyard. It must be the graveyard. Boom! There's lots of people there, but none of them can speak. You see? Hmm. So let's get going. It, is, it does give off a very cold chill as well. Alright, limit is midnight to midnight. That's good then. Let's on our little trolls. I'm all fucking driving, seriously. God damn it, game! Ah, that's not what I wanted. Wait, is that. Okay, that's not the right way we want to go. I wanna. Drive. Oh, you fucking moron. Let's go! Might have to flare out a new car soon. Okay, let's hope that this is the right way to go. Any talking, we'll explain it on the way, but for now, let's just. Uh, now we won't even wait in silence. We'll just keep on coming backwards and forwards when there's talking to do, otherwise, it's just. A lot of crawly crap. Ooh, this is where the total's gonna happen. The meter on that bridge is slightly different from what I think about her now. Don't you think she's pretty mesmerizing? Aww. And Zach, no, she seemed shopping. interested in you. Did you make a move on her? How? No, that's right. Just asking. But if you like her, there we go. Sometimes when your car goes too fast, you want to lose control. It's weird because your car just. All of it. Kind of so much damn speed. Me? I'm just interested in her, that's all. It doesn't Hey, it starts that though. From what I can tell, she doesn't even seem to like me. Ah! Well, that's where you could be wrong. Cautious with me. It's because I was badly burned in my last relationship. What do you mean by badly burned? I really have no idea what women are thinking. That's oh. my problem. See, the problem is, like, when you're speeding around with this Maybe car... you should teach me about how to interact with women. Or with any car, to be honest, in this game. It's just... Oh, fuck, I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? I really have, haven't I? I'm literally going back down the same way I came. For fuck's sake. It is a shortcut, though. Not gonna lie. But if I carry on going the same way as I did, it would have taken the same amount of time, really. Oh well. That's what I get for trying to think I know where to go. Oh, I just need to think take a left and we're back on track to where we need to be. But e either way, now they stop talking, I can be much longer. The problem is, though, when I don't want to keep on doing See, what I only try and do. Turn down the sound. Because the car sounds way too high. Where's my options? Uh, sound adjustment, please. Okay, volt volume is high. Let's take this to 85. Let's take this to 85. Good. Yes. Cancel. No! No! No, 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 no. Crap. Did I just reset it? I did. Fuck's sake. 85. No, 100. 85. Bip, 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 bip. Okay. Yes. Okay. No, we don't. We go like, okay. Yes, I do. And then we... Okay, click exit. Yes. You change now. Good. No, 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 no. Yes, I want to cancel my changes. There we go. 
might be quiet for us now. Eh, it's still a bit too loud, but the voice might overpower it soon. If they speak again, that's the problem though. It's like, anything you do is way louder than the voice acting. And we don't want that shit. Yeah. At least we've got a battery, though, everyone's out of the way, we don't have to crash into any other things. Maybe a gate from time to time, because that's the thing that can happen. But oh well, nothing we can do about it now. And that See, I'd like to know what happens when my bar goes to red, when I just jet off somewhere into the fucking aether and just disappear. That'd be quite... Whoa, game! Jesus! What happened there? The controller's not dying on me, is it? Yeah, it's been fine. I don't know what happened there. I didn't want to listen to me. Oh god, I need to check more fuel soon. My car is getting pretty banged up, but that should be our label. We'll be able to... Take a right when we get to it. I'm hoping if I run out of stamina, I'm just gonna fucking jet and then on a straight line so I can floor it. That'd be ideal. Oh, I'm sorry. Let's slow down a bit. Yes, see. Even Emily could be targeted next. Can't that out. Oh, we can't. All the more reason to catch the raincoat killer ASAP. Exactly. Working closely together. Oh, we do anyway. We can work out the Emily situation later. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, Sam. I mean, I'm not interested in Emily because she's female. Uh huh. Yeah, sure. I'm just saying she's interesting. You know, as in interesting, interesting person. person. Yeah, yeah, sure. But by looking at her, she reminds me of something I used to feel. That's all. Don't roll like up. back when I first met you. You know that feeling we all used to feel back when we were kids. Feeling safe while also feeling uh, But he's an imaginary guy, yo. You should know this, right? But Zach, who made me feel that back then? Anyways, we're getting closer one step at a time to cracking this case. We do. We are. I have a feeling it's going to get tough. Oh, don't you fucking say that to me. Well, we're done talking, so... Oh god, I should have ended it. We'll end it after this cutscene, then. See, slow progress is getting made, but still. Progress is progress and all that. Just as Harry said, it's crowded and quiet. So many stones. And there's three more still here. Or still to come. Ah, Brian the Insomniac. Hey, Brian. Hello, Agent York. Agent. Mr. Agent. How are there's pebble miss on the floor. Oh, uh, not bad. Why is the pebble miss on the floor? I'm uh just playing a little game with Harry. Game? A game? Oh, uh, is that fun? We've only just started, Brian. The fun is about to begin. I'd like to. Ask Why is there pebble miss on the floor, Mister Brian? Is there a tree in the graveyard that drops red seeds? Seeds. Red seeds. That? That tree does. Our first victim was literally around here. Whoa. And that one. And that one too. Okay. Hmm. Something doesn't feel right about this place no longer. And that's what makes me feel a bit uneasy about tomorrow's video. Why the fuck is there pelt mist everywhere? Well, either way, I know we don't do much on these games anymore, but we're trying to keep it at a slow, steady pace, so it's... You know... I will do an hour video every now and again, or every 20 minutes or something like that, you know? I did say I'm going to move it to 15 minutes, but I'm going to go against that now. I'm going to try and stick with the 20 things. Sometimes, I know it's going to be a hard time sometimes because of all the driving and the stuff and all the time in between when you've got a lot of time left on your hands. Like for example, it's only 10.48 now and time has slowed. Why is the timer red? I've got no limit to do this in, so same with the 0 to 0. My, my, my clock's not going crazy in my start button, is it? No. But it looks like the time has st stopped still, because the flowers are rising. That time isn't moving. But, anyway, I'm going to leave. No, no, mine's moving. 
I'm going to leave that there for today with this video of Deadly Premonition. I know we've not done much, but we're slowly getting somewhere. And I'm going to keep it like this until we get to somewhere new. Plus it also gives me time to mention a few things while we're driving about what's happening. It gives a nice little feel for things. But anyway, I'm going to leave that there for today. And I'm going to leave you with Rebirthing by Skillet. Enjoy. Hey,